What are you going to miss most about your job? My kids. My kids. And, and the friends that I've met here, but really my kids. I know her. She is such a special lady. Covering news that matters in Sand Springs. A special education teacher is retiring after 43 years of teaching. What a remarkable career. Fox 23's Amy Hybels joins us live from Limestone Technology Academy with her story, Amy. Well, that's right. This is the last day of school out here at this elementary school building, but it's also the last day in the classroom for 65 year old Vicki Harbaugh, who is saying goodbye to teaching. You know, she started her career as a teacher in 1979. Back then, my Sharona topped the charts, the music charts that is that fall. Jimmy Carter was president. A lot has changed in the past four decades, but the one thing that's remained unchanged is her love for the kids. We caught up with Vicki Harbaugh on her last day in the classroom, the same room she's taught special education classes in for the past 30 years. Harbaugh says a lot has changed over the years. I had a, a totally self-contained classroom when I started here, and my kids would go out for like music and PE. And as the years went by, they went out for more and more, and so now they're out and I just pull them back in for like reading or math instruction. She thinks the change is a good thing for the most part. And I think there are definitely are benefits, especially socially, because they're in a classroom with their peers. I can pull kids in when I need to pull them in and they know that they can come in my room if they need to, if they need a break or they need to come in. In addition to teaching special needs children for a total of 43 years, Harbaugh has also helped coach Special Olympics. Here she's pictured with this year's softball team. What are you gonna miss most about your job? My kids. My kids and, and the friends that I've met here, but really my kids. Her co-worker celebrated her this week by throwing her a party. Her next chapter includes helping to care for her new grandson. This is the last day of school right now. Vicki's inside the gymnasium with about 280 kids watching the end of your talent show. We asked Principal Terry Lee what she thinks her legacy will be. <laughs> She takes each child and she finds their individual strengths and if you just think about the hundreds, probably thousands of students that she has taught in her lifetime, that's her legacy children. We asked one of her students, Abby O'Brien, what she'd like to say to her beloved teacher on her very last day. You're the best teacher ever. I wish you could stay. And no doubt she is not the only one that feels that way out here and in fact in this entire community. Now while Harbaugh got her start in teaching in 1979, she tells me she came to this building in 1993. She told me that as a third grader while volunteering with special needs kids with her Girl Scout troop, that's when she knew that this is what she wanted to do for the rest of her life. In Sand Springs, covering News That Matters, I'm Amy Hybels, Fox 23 News.